When it comes to drones, one brand rises above all others. DJI, based in Shenzhen, China, has captured the drone market for everything from amateur photography, to fighting wildfires, to protecting sensitive sites. And this is a problem, say U.S. cybersecurity watchdogs. In January, the FBI and the U.S. Cybersecurity and Infrastructure Security Agency warned that laws enacted in recent years by the Chinese government give it the ability to look at any data collected by Chinese firms. Drones used widely across the U.S. could become tools for spying, the agencies say. You could think of a police department in a major city using a drone where the feed might be accessible to the Chinese government. You could think of drones being used by the military, by the Forest Service, by federal agencies, uh, by fire departments. And so it, it could give you insight into the public safety structure of the United States and a little bit into the national security. The concern is not new. In 2021, DJI was sanctioned, along with other Chinese manufacturers, who the U.S. said made products that could be used for spying. And last year, the U.S. Congress passed a bill banning the purchase and use of Chinese-made drones by federal agencies, as well as state and local agencies using federal funding for the purchase. The Chinese government objects to claims of spying. The U.S. has overstretched the concept of national security and fabricates all kinds of excuses to abuse export controls to unreasonably suppress Chinese institutions and firms. The new guidance, which did not cite any specific incidents, encourages the adoption of American-made drones equipped with security features. But Chinese drones have proved reliable and far less expensive than comparable American models. The Chinese government was very strategic in subsidizing certain industries that they thought would give it an intelligence advantage. Though the U.S. Army and some federal agencies have banned the use of Chinese drones, many other agencies still use and depend on the equipment they've invested in. The new warning aims to speed up a transition, says Lewis. It makes people step back and say, it's not just the price tag that reflects the full cost of buying this drone. There's a security risk. In a statement, DJI said, customers only share flight logs, images, or videos with us if they affirmatively choose to do so, and that users can always fly offline without connecting to the internet. With more eyes in the sky every day, questions about who is looking and why will only increase. Matt Dibble, VOA News, Oakland, California.